that I'm at an all time. Hey, what's going on, guys? I better be having a great day. By the way, last video I made, very happy with all the positive feedback. Thank you guys so much. Shout out all of you that commented. I try to like like the comments or reply to them. Um, you know, in some form of way, I respond to see that I saw you because, you know, it's not like I'm getting exploded with comments yet. Um, but I did see someone that say they wanted to see another claw cam because they're having difficulty with it. Once again, shout out to that person. I can pull it up here and see what their name was. Shouts out to the name. Uh, but once again, yeah, thank you so much for the positive feedback. I'm sorry. Like I said, I'm, I'm trying to get on the schedule, but every time I try to, I just like something happens in my life that just completely ruins it. Honestly, like that's all, that's all I can say. 22 views on that video. Like I said, for, uh. You know what I mean? For, like, what it is, for what, like, the fact that I uploaded, like, two weeks, that's awesome. And that's in, what, 20... I'm like, a dot a day. There's six comments, just awesome people, you know. Um, and then, once again, shout-outs. Where did that comment go? Okay, right here. Mr. Mark De Santiago. I'm sorry if I messed it up. Says, I was wondering if you could do another claw cam video, please. I'm having trouble. Help, please. Okay. Like I said, this is big. Shout out to him. I'm so glad to hear you, like, suggest a video. Um, so, you know, now I know what I'm doing for the day, I guess. So, once again, I'm about to set up. Um, the first time I did it, I did do it on PlayStation. If you didn't see that video, by the way, I'll put it down in the description if I remember to. I really hope I do. So, you can go ahead and watch that. I did that one on the PlayStation for IW. I figured for this one, I'm going to do the Xbox for Black Ops 3. Um, once again, you'll see here, I don't use a scuff. I don't use anything in any form of way. Now, if you're trying to play claw and you're like a younger person and you don't have like huge hands, I have huge hands. So playing claw for me just works absolutely fine. Um, but like I said, if you're like a younger type of kid and you haven't quite like developed these giant like meat cleavers, or I guess if you want to call it, I don't really know. But um, you're going to have trouble because your hands are going to grip the Xbox controller, especially being bigger than the PlayStation 4 controller. But I have huge hands. Like if I just compare it to the controller here sort of, like, my hands are freaking, they're big. I can just grab the controller. Like, it's not that big of a deal to me. But um, for the PlayStation being a smaller, you know, controller, it's going to be easier for those. Um, but if you're having difficulty, like I said, and you have smaller hands and you can't afford a scuff because I know they're damn expensive. I went to Walmart the other day. Now I was just looking through the game section. And Microsoft has actually released this thing where you just um, connect it. Like, you remove this cover. Okay, and you plug it right in. It has a battery, but it also has these little paddles. So it's almost like a scuff that you can just modify your like basic Xbox controller to. Like I said, I don't see me doing it for one. It feels like a waste of 20 bucks because I can just play Claw. And secondly, um, it's just like I said, I can play Claw, so I don't need it. <laughs> so anyway, but once again, if you are, you know, having trouble with it or you don't feel you're doing it quite right, I'm gonna try and show you guys tips and tricks. I'm about to set up to where you guys will see my 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 claw cam instead of the thing uh once again the original video the inspiration because for no, those of you that are just clicking on this video or those of you like that have never watched any of my other videos um i am a huge fan of optic scumpy and he used to do these back in the day that's where i developed it from but you know what i mean there's nothing wrong with using there's nothing wrong with taking like there's so much content made anymore it's hard to make something original and new i just did it because i play call thoroughly he's one of the like i watched his videos i learned and now i play now i don't got to spend eight million dollars on a controller or whatever i can just pick up a controller and use it how it is and still feel comfortable with the way i can play i can still play these jetpack games and jump up in the air and you guys see how i play once again i'm just gonna move to the thing now i'll see you guys in a second Alright, anyway guys, I'm here. You can see the game. I'm going to go ahead and search like a dem game while we're just chilling. But this is how I play Call of Duty. Once again, I haven't switched controllers or nothing, mind you. This is still just my basic controller. I'm not trying to play you guys or nothing. But this is how I play. I also play tactical. So sliding and, uh, you know, and whatnot is with this. And my melee button is B. I don't really melee that much, especially not in this game, being that it's not a one-hit kill melee. But essentially, this is how I play the game. So at all times, I'm able to, like, jump, aim, shoot, move. Like, I'm all able to do that all at once, see? Because I can jump, shoot, aim, you know, move around. Um, you know, and whenever I need to, like, reload, I just click real quick. Or I double tap Y or B. It's just, oh, so all convenient, you know, streaks. I just real quick, just like that. Um, this is, you know, I don't really use any tacticals or lethals. What the heck? Oh, <laughs> I was like, where are my classes at? So once again, yeah, I'm going to try to give this a go. Let me see if I can get comfortable here. 
this is this is just how I do it, guys. I don't spend. I always get uh, messages of people that are salty, and they. Uh, And they are so mad, they're like, you pay to win, and you're a, you know. Woo. Okay. But anyway, I always get messages, and it's like, just because you don't know how to play Claw, or you suck at the game or something, doesn't mean, doesn't mean I have to. Okay, there's no one even over here. I was about to say, if we can just defuse that real quick, that would be much appreciated. Looks like they kind of... Oh, I didn't know where I wanted to go. I'm about to jump off the map. I, I was pushing forward. I could have sworn I was pushing forward, but I guess I just kind of got caught up on the embankment. This is my first game today, so the... Uh, jumping and shooting, especially in like Black Ops 3 and IW, is a very huge advantage. I don't know how useful this video would be now, just because in the newer game, it, uh, what was it, World War Two? There's, you know, there's no jetpack, so this. I mean, you can still play call. You can do a regular jump and shoot like this. You'll still have a very. I'm not doing too good, guys. You're still gonna have a very good advantage to be able to jump. Also, like I said, with, I feel like in this game, I haven't, I didn't play the beta at all, so I don't know what it's like. But you, you know, drop shotting. That's why I play. That's why I play tactical from the start. Was because back in the like older Call of Duties. Black Ops 1, Black Ops 2, they, drop shotting was very, you know what I mean, it was kind of famous. In this game, not so much. It's all, it's better to jump and strafe in this game. Uh, not to mention, newbies always seem to shoot at your feet anyway, so you just drop shot and they're just getting a headshot on you anyway. Is this guy is still camping here. I'm not going to be too happy about it. He's not, okay. I always reload too fast. I get ahead of myself. My sense feels like it's up insanely high or something. I got kind of dick there. I try to couch, crouch to make my, you know, body mass a little bit smaller, but it's still picking me up with that suppressed locus, unfortunately. Oh man, it's kind of like I saw a teammate there, so I didn't. I don't know. I guess I didn't expect anyone. Oh, we're planting. I don't know why I thought we were defending. For instance, if I hadn't jumped right there, maybe that breaking out of like, I don't know, headshot me or something. Or like, this is a huge advantage, like right here especially. On this little embankment to be able to strafe and whatnot. Oh. Oh, man. Ah, uh, the MSMC. That thing is such a melt machine. I want to get it. This is the first game of the day, guys. I don't think it's important to how well I'm doing is... As much as it is to kind of feature, you know, oh, I, my God, guys, I, this is, <laughs> this is why you always got to do a warm-up. If you're a YouTuber, you have to do, I should have did a warm-up game before I started. Like I said, gameplay not as important as it would be to just like that. Like, if I didn't jump in that situation, you know, he probably would have killed me. I don't know. I'm just trying to, you know, show how utilized it is. I'm actually just gonna push this out. Oh, I saw someone. Oh, ah, he caught me. That's how you just jump. I'm starting to get a little heated. I'm trying to decipher if I still wanna play two games for you guys or not. Oh, he had the, uh... oh my God, I've never picked, I've never, I haven't used this weapon yet in Black Ops three so we'll see how this goes not too much he has a suppress so that normally takes a little bit more i would dare say it takes a little bit more comfort of the game oh my god they're trying to take me all out this feels so much different in black ops 3 as opposed to black ops 2 feels like a completely different gun it does still feel just as overpowered though Okay, man, I have no idea how he survived that. I still am sitting a little bit uncomfortably. Uh, 
You know what I mean? Because I'm like trying to show, like I had to hold my hands straight while at the while at the same time at the same time attempting to. See, like, that, that's just, in my opinion, that's just... Okay, I need one of you to push up and plant this bomb. I'll push up and kill. Oh my god, please jump! <laughs> okay, what do you need to push up and plant? I'll push in here and hold it down. That was a double kill. Boom, utilizing claw. I'll have to drop a hater for the next round. Ooh, we're on a 10. A real quick one. I don't want to use that because there's only 20. Ooh! Oh, they defused it. We didn't have much time left. We do have a hater going into the next round, though, so this is looking awesome. We pulled it out. We have now a 3 KD once again, so it's turning around a little bit. I'm starting to get a little bit heated. Um, once again, like, this is just, you can just see so many situations where being able to jump and shit at the same time is awesome. I'm not too sure specifically, you know, what you're having trouble with. I don't know if you play on Xbox or PlayStation, but I hope this is helping in some form of way. So the person that requested this comment, or for anyone watching this video. Once again, if not, like I said, if you go to Walmart, you're near Walmart, and go to, like, that gaming section, they did have that neat little... You know, doohiggy, whatever the heck I call it, it adds paddles to your... I don't think in any way, shape, or form I was gonna... I don't know how. Like, you can even see in the kill cam, I had first shot and I didn't miss a bullet. Did he have rapid fire on? I wasn't really paying attention. He melted me pretty quickly. That's so unfortunate, because I'd have the power core. I'd be knocking out, you know, their streaks while, you know, blinding them. I was playing so well, you know what I mean? I dropped the hater and then boom, like out of nowhere, just playing like poop again, I guess. They got a hater. I'm getting melted like a bitch now. He's gonna get that bomb planted. I don't know where he is. Ooh, we had a ripper. Okay, that one bomb's gone. We gotta get the B. Oh, they got a wraith too. Eh, I don't know. Seems like a little bit of a lost cost. Oh my god, how did I lose that? I don't know what my teammates are doing. Ah, the only one guy, the one guy below me is positive by two. So, not only was I not heated, but, you know, on top of that, <laughs> given the situation, it just isn't really looking like a win okay I will admit sometimes relying on jumping is so bad because of situations like that where I go to jump and then I do just mantle something and I'm like no that is, that's not what I wanted you to do we haven't lost yet I guess it's not over you know till the fat lady sings as they must say but you see I got 1 in 16 8 and 25 10 and 16 11 13, 17 15 like he's plus 2 I'm still running like a 2 KD like it's not the best but I'm trying. Oh, we lost. I forgot that we lost that first round. That's just unfortunate. But anyway, once again, not too worried about the gameplay itself, and more or less the clock cam. And once again, I hope it helped. I'm only going to play one game just because I feel like dragging this on to play two games is just not going to be very beneficial and a waste of your guys' time. Once again, for Xbox, that's just pretty much how I handle it. You know, I hope you were kind of watching the movement. I hope it was really helping. Um, but that's about it. That's just how I play. You know, to all the haters out there that might be on this video that have ever across me and they message me because I have I can literally scroll up and down how many people that just like you know like you pay to win and shit I'm like dude just go to my YouTube channel I've even done videos of how I play and I I will dead straight like I've had so many people message me like oh you pay to win or you, you know you cheater like for one I don't get how a scuff is cheating in the first place you still all it literally does is give you the availability to jump and shoot and all that stuff at the same time it's not like you put on wall hacks or uh, like headshot or some shit I don't know like they get so mad but then on top of that, here you go. 
I don't know what else I'm going to say. I unlocked Reflex with the MSMC if you didn't catch that. I don't have the weapon unlocked yet, but uh, just an update on that. I have two. I'm building up my rare supply drops. Oh, I guess you can only hold on to two. I have two of them right there ready to go. And then on top of that, I'm working on the... Like I said, I, I if you guys don't believe me, I like when I was gone for two weeks, I literally didn't play. I only have 29 out of 125 wins towards that thing, but... I'm gonna try and do save up a bunch of crypto keys and I'm gonna do try and do some form of supply drop opening type of thing. If not, I'm gonna just spend like eight hundred dollars because I need that MSMC or even that AN. I picked up that AN and oh my god, that thing is so overpowered. This thing right here. I really want the Galil just because it's the Galil. Like this was my favorite weapon in Black Ops One. I don't know how good it actually is. I know this thing is overpowered, but it'd just be cool to have. And then once again, like I said, that uh I never, I haven't gotten a single DLC sub. Like, that's how unfortunate I am. Even this thing would be cool, the PPSH or the. I think the MSMC is still. It, it's kind of, you know, it's still pretty strong. Anyway, I hope you guys did enjoy. I hope it did help you guys that needed help with that type of thing. I'm just gonna, you know, fix it and continue because I'm a beast like that. But um, once again, I hope it did, did enjoy. If you did, drop a like for that. And if you didn't enjoy, if it did help you, if this helped you, like you're not sure how to play and you're trying to figure out how all these people are jumping around you and shit and killing you and you're struggling with it i hope it did help with that and if it did drop a like and if you guys are new and enjoyed the video you know you love me and you love my my beautiful ugly face subscribe you know come back to the channel hit that bell or whatever for your mobile notifications i'll be trying to upload at least every other day from now on i should have time now you know what i mean my schedule is kind of being consistent you know i'm settled back in from where i was and we're rolling once again, I love you guys very much. See you guys in the next video. it recently